looking to move away and start a better life, Mars is the place for you. Mars is now a booming society 50 years after first colonization. This isn't the dangerous, empty, difficult place you might remember from your childhood. Mars natives have successfully terraformed the planet, built up luxury housing, and they're just waiting for their new neighbors to move in. If you're tired of cramped, lowly Earth conditions, and you've got the money to test out a hip new housing location, call We interrupt our program to bring you this important message. I'm speaking to you as a representative of Rooted, the Mars Rebel Association. Wealthy Earth dwellers are not welcome on our planet. When we were first sent to Mars, conditions were still dangerous. The atmosphere was still thin, there were no outposts for or promises of emergency supplies, and the danger of the UV exposure was still extremely high. We accepted those terms to work our way up from the lows of society and have built a space where we can be free and happy. Now you want to move in like this planet was meant for you all along? You are not welcome here. We have developed a sophisticated anti-government identification system to differentiate ourselves from others. Our identification system uses retinal tissue to create a morphing pattern based on UV exposure in the form of a monocle. The scaffold of identification lens mimics the unique pattern of the wearer's iris, leading the ID back to them and only them. Underneath the wearer's own retinal tissue grows. This tissue slowly grows out on the bacterial cellulose due to the nutrient layer underneath. As the retinal pigment epithelium is exposed to UV radiation, it randomly kills and stalls some areas of growth as well as photobleaching the UV sensitive opsins and pigments. A protective layer in between this and the outside prevents the tissue from mechanical harm and is semi permeable to UV so the tissue can still slowly grow and change. As the tissue changes, it creates a new form that's even more unique and signifies native.